growing up, I was into street shit. Hustling out of Grand Marquis Caprice. People are way. Two, one, and it's lit. Welcome back to another episode of Lit Podcast, you know what I'm talking about. And once again, we in season four, and we got another special guest we got to put on the pedestal in honor in our motherfucking city of D-Town, you know what I'm saying, Triple right. D. You know what I'm saying, today we got trouble two times in the building. Whoa, we up in this bitch, man. Y'all know what it is, nutty now stand up, man. Real niggas stand up. Like a motherfucker. D-Town motherfuck. stand up, you know what I'm talking about. Man, tell everybody, man, man, how you doing, nigga, and where you from, you know what I'm talking about. Man, I'm blessed, man. Too blessed to be stressed, man. I'm from North Dallas, started to be at Zach Kingsley. You know what I'm talking about? 10, 8, 50 block, 82 stand up. They know what it is, bro. All through the north, really, though. I ripped that whole bitch, you know what I mean? I want to North Dallas Project, baby, man. I come out from parking straight to the projects and then work my way around the north, so mm -hmm. I really ripped that whole bitch. You know what I'm saying? For yeah, real, that's, that's my home. That. Yeah, that's my home, you know what I mean? So. I, I represent for, I represent the whole bitch too and for the people around the whole bitch. Nothing you now stand up, y'all know what the fuck going on. Already, so you heard what he said. So for people out there, you know what I'm saying, that's you know, kinda dumb, deaf or underneath the rock or something, you know what I'm saying? Don't know, you know what I'm saying, the trouble two times is man, this man been putting in work, man. I've been watching him, you know what I'm saying, putting grind, been giving y'all some like some G music, you know what I'm saying? Like that music, like that throwback music that y'all need to be having in y'all trunk, but y'all ain't nobody out here trying to pay attention. But it's people paying attention, don't get me right. wrong, but y'all sleeping, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like and for the people out here, man, that don't know you, you know what I'm saying? Like, tell them, man, what you got out there, man. Like, what, man, what you got? I got a bunch of shit out there, man. You know, I came out last year. Really and came that's a, and that's and that's that's the saying that's the the trip about it. You know what I'm saying? You came out last year, mm -hmm. but you dropped so much in such a you know what I'm saying? Small <laughs> yeah, frame right, of time. <laughs> I dropped two mixtapes in, in one year, so it was a heavy load. But I really, really. I dropped two mixtapes in like six months. So it was like I dropped a mixtape, I waited like uh, four months and dropped another one. So my whole goal was when I started rapping was to do this was like, you know what I mean? Niggas don't know I rap, so the biggest thing is everybody know me in the streets for some G shit. Or you know what I mean? Right. All that old negative ass bullshit, you know what I mean? My name been ringing in the streets, so it was like, in order for people to not know me as a gangster but know me as a rapper, what can I what do I need to do? So it was like shit, you need to keep dropping videos, you need to drop a bunch of music out there so when people get on you, as soon as they click it, they can be like, damn, bro, been, look at all this shit. I ain't heard none of this shit. I got two I got two mixtapes, six, seven videos. Like, you know what I mean? My shit was to come out the door swing and that was my whole plan. You know what I mean? Right. I really, you know what I mean, I was I was really done with rap. I, I freestyled and shit like that, but like I said, I went to that uh, to that apartment video with Boosie and Mo3, you know what I'm saying, and you know, Mo3 made sure I got my respect due up in that bitch, right. you know what I'm saying, like, you know what I mean, oh shit, made sure I was where I was supposed to be at in the video and shit, you know what I mean, made me feel like shit. So getting your cameo on. Yeah, nah, yeah. for real though, but, right. really, but really making sure a nigga got his cameo. You know, any nigga could jump in a nigga video and get a cameo. Right, 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 right. You know what I mean, but when that nigga say, say nigga, him, him, him right up. Where shot nigga get behind him, you know what I'm saying, that shit made me. I, I was yeah, like, oh shit, that. I could right. be a fucking, I could be a rapper too, you right, know what I mean? Right. So shit, after the apartment video, I left the set, you know what I'm talking about, I had bad, I was bad up at the time, you know what I'm saying, I ain't saying that I ain't now, but yeah, I was bad up at the time, so, boom, I left the video motivated, I was like, shit, I'm finna go buy me a studio, and then I'm finna buy all the fucking equipment, right. you hear me, so I left the video, that next day, nigga, I go into Guitar Center, I already knew what I needed, because I know niggas who rap, you know what right. I had been around Lil Will, Dosky, T Cash, all of them, you know what I'm talking about? Mm -hmm. During their career, yeah. you know what I'm saying? When they was rapping and I wasn't rapping, I was just hanging around just on some street shit. You feel what I'm saying? Square business, I'll be at all their shows and shit at the studio. I'm seeing them work that shit. So, you know, when I finally decided to start rapping, I knew everything I needed. So I went to the store, copped that shit, set that shit up in the house, called one of my, uh, my niggas who an engineer. He came over there, made sure all that shit was set up, put Pro Tools on that bitch. First song I recorded was Walking Down. First song, you know what I'm saying? First song came on that mic, on the mic I bought was Walking Down. And I was like, oh yeah, this song jam. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Did a video like two days later, called my nigga Vic KB, you know what I mean? With Prophecy, man, him been knowing each other for years. You know what I'm saying? Film. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's a real nigga, man. Shout out Prophecy, that's yeah. my, you know what I mean? Drop some shit, man. Yeah, shout out Prophecy, but yeah. definitely shout out KB though, man. Mm -hmm. KB, that's his partner, they, they, you know what I mean? They, 
together. Yeah, they together. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? But he wanted to like his prophecy thing, but it's KB. You know what I mean? He and he involved, and that's a good friend of mine, man. You know what I mean? From the, from the root, nigga. I mean, we would, you know what I mean? I wasn't rapping, but really, and he was still working a job, nigga. So, call my nigga up, call uh, bro up. He linked, we put the video together, look, but he been still grinding. He done elevated, I done elevated. It's like looking at bro, we done came with it. Drop walk him down, nigga. Everybody was fucking with that hoe. That hoe went, went up, you know what I'm saying? That hoe had 30,000 views right now, which it ain't a lot of views, but you gotta think about it. For your side of town, you know what I mean? That's a street hit, you know right, what I mean? Right. That's a street hit. So I drop walk him down, boom. Right after I drop walk him down, I back door, you know what I'm saying? Lucci just coming home from the feds. He ain't even home, he's still in the halfway house. So right. I call Lucci uh, up, I got the track Avenue. Yeah. I'm like, shit, bro, I want you to jump on this hoe. He left, he was working, nigga, left the halfway house, left his job, nigga, early, came to my house, recorded that shit, and went back to the halfway house. Then we dropped Avenue. Avenue was another big one, you know what I'm saying? Like, another North Dallas classic, like everybody knows about Lucha, it. Man. You know Showing that love. And shout out to Lucha. Our opinion, shout out to Mo3. Yeah, man, man really. and North really, bro, like, right. North really motivated me the whole way. Nah, square business. Nah, that's some real but, shit. But, you know, Lucha came through with that shit, and, uh, that was another outside hit. Those are two. Those are songs that I feel like really broke broke the waves. It was songs in between those and shit like that. You know what I mean? Like those real songs that niggas could feel, like right. the ones that you don't listen to, like Crack Rock Kid, right. April Fools, yeah. all of them motherfuckers. I got a bunch of shit out, but you know what I mean? Those songs really took the cake. And then right now, you know what I mean? I just dropped another. One. I hadn't dropped for like the last six months. And then I man, just came out in Afghanistan. Man, so. you was ringing bells, man. You was saying, man, I'm talking about niggas come to say, man. You, you, you ain't on trouble. Yeah, man, you need to really. get up on trouble. My boy D. Lou talking about, man, you ain't heard trouble. Nah, you know what I'm saying? Nah, you be checking my nigga trouble out, man. I'm finna call my nigga nah, right now. I'm finna call a nigga up right now, man. man. You know what I'm saying? And that was damn near man, shit a year ago. That shit. was love, though, uh -huh. man. That's love, man. It's a, a lot of my shit move by word of mouth, man. Cause shit, right. I can, my shit touch certain spirits, man. That shit, that shit, uh, that shit real life music, bro. So if you hear it, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm gonna speak my struggle and some shit, so. You know what I mean? Being that we all from the gutter, man, got struggles relate. Right. You know what I mean? So if I say something that move a person, I know I be doing it. I say shit that can move a motherfucker so much that it be like, damn, bro, you got to hear this shit. Like, right. you know what I mean? Nigga might not even really be telling you why he wants you to hear the song. Right. You right. feel what I'm saying? Right. Right. But he just tell you, listen to this hoe. Like, right. nigga, nigga, it might be a part where I'm talking about my T. Jones with her drug addiction or something like that. This nigga mama might be going through a drug addiction. He ain't telling you. That's why he feel the song, but he gonna tell you, man, listen to this hoe. You know right. what I'm saying? So, you know, it's a bunch of reasons. That's why I fuck with that real shit, man, because, you know, when you're speaking that real shit, the struggle is universal, yeah. my nigga. Yeah. Yeah. They going through this in Africa. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Europe. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Uh, Australia. Everywhere we at, man, the struggle of Europe is universal, bro. So if you can tap into a motherfucking struggle, bro, we can, and you can go far. That's what I always believe. You know what I'm saying? Been, man. So how long you really been rapping, man? Like, what, what, when, when you really just jumped off the porch and would say, like, like, I, I can, now nah, I can really do this. I mean, I always been able to uh, do this. Yeah, yeah. No, nah, no bullshit. Like, yeah. even when I was a kid, like. Right. I was out of our generation, I was the nigga that they knew could rap. You right, know what I'm right. saying? Like Lil Will was the nigga in their generation in mm -hmm. the older uh in the older hood generation, they older than me, so we looked up to a lot of them. You know what I'm saying? He was the nigga who could rap for them. You know what I'm saying? So we'll have freestyle sessions up in apartments. It'll be Lil Will, motherfucking a couple more niggas who was known for rapping, and then I'll be up in the mix, though. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Right. I'll be spitting there, go, I go, boom, nigga like damn Lil Bro go hard in the bitch. So, you know, I always been rapping, but that was when I was a kid, though. You know what I mean? Then right. I got a juvenile license. Right, you feel what right. I'm saying? I got took off the streets. I was 13, yeah. finna be 14. I got took off the streets. I ain't come back home till I was 18. So a lot of, like I say, I was rapping. Yeah. When, before I went to jail, I knew all, 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 all us know right. each other. You know what I mean? But y'all, all that gap was a race. Yeah, yeah, all that gap was a race. So <laughs> me coming home, when I came home, you know what I'm saying, from uh, the juvenile license, I really wasn't, I ain't really fuck with rap. Like, you know what I'm saying, I was rapping, I could rap, like I bust a freestyle here and there, but I didn't fuck with it because I ain't like the way what was going on, you know what I mean? I'm right. like, you know what I mean, no disrespect, I ain't like that dance music shit. Right, right, I wasn't right, feeling that right, shit. Right, I always right, knew right. that my shit was gonna always be 
some gangster music. You feel what I'm saying? And then it was like, you know what I mean? When I spit, I, I had songs that I had recorded and shit, and niggas just wasn't feeling it. You right, feel what right. I'm saying? So I was like, it ain't my, I just felt like, fuck rap. You know what I'm talking about? Right. Niggas ain't pushing my shit. I done jumped on niggas. It's a bunch of niggas, mixtapes, nigga, who was doing that dance movement shit and shit like that. That I put tracks on them niggas, mixtapes and shit. Come back around and them took me out the track. It was just a bunch of weird shit. So it just demotiv it just didn't it wasn't I wasn't motivated. Right. I stepped back. Boom. But then here come this motherfucking hot blazing ass nigga spitting that gangster shit. You know what I'm saying? Turn the fucking city up though. Brought it back. Fuck what a nigga talking about. You know what I'm saying? When I heard that nigga, yeah. I said, okay, this nigga on the radio, nigga. What little Mo three nigga on the nigga putting me on Mo three, but you know what I'm saying my little niggas they best friends with this nigga. Right. But you know niggas was putting me on nigga hear that nigga on the radio nigga hold your tongue. Then he come back booms silence everything he dropped he talking about stepping on shit. It was like a trigger like boom right. that's what that's the music that's that loot shit that's that old shit that's that, that, that gangster shit that this that representing yeah, the knock yeah. this is what the knock <laughs> about man yeah. so you know with that being that I feel like it was my time to come out okay so let right. me represent. Let me show right. these niggas, you know what I mean? Cause right. everybody already know what it is with me up in the streets. You know right. what I'm talking about? Right. Square business. I'm one of the I'm one of them niggas, you know what I'm saying? Niggas know shit. Ain't no ain't no milf. You feel yeah, what I'm saying? Right, right, Square right. business. You know right. what I mean? This that's shit how, is, That's how K Rock was. Yeah, ain't no milf. That's how, that's how K Rock. Nah, nah. You you remind me of K Rock. You know what I'm saying? Nah, for you know, real. Nah, for real, for real, for real. You know what I'm saying? Like shout out K Rock. Square you know, business. Shout out K Rock. You man. know what I'm saying? You remind me straight up K Rock, man. It's for real. Yo, man, we come out spitting that shit, man. Yeah. I hear that shit. I'm like, yo, man. G time. Say hey, man. Time for the gangsters to come in. All you bitch ass niggas step back. You know what I'm saying? Unfortunately, you know what I'm saying. You know that shit transpired with. Uh, Mo three and shit. So that was definitely demotivating. That shit definitely, you know what I mean, fucked me up too. You know what I'm right, talking about? Right. That fucked me up too. You know what I'm talking about? Just from a motivational point. You feel what I'm saying? You know what I mean? But you know, I kept striving, kept spitting, keep spitting, and keep striving. You know what I'm saying? I make sure I put bro up in this video, tell the nigga long live three, and we are gonna keep this shit going for the night. You know what I mean? On some raw shit. So like, what's the what's that what's the process? You know you. Going through making your albums, like who who you who in production and like, man, I'ma tell you like this, babe. First, you know what I'm saying. First, when I first jumped out, bro, I was big jack. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like we all, <laughs> yeah, yeah, swipe, you know <laughs> steal your shit. You know what I'm right. talking about? Make a hit to your shit. Right. You feel what I'm saying? Squirt yeah, yeah. put that bitch out. Fuck what they talking about. You know what I'm saying? I ain't got no money for you to take, but you know then. As I started learning the business, you know what I'm saying? I had to get serious about my business right. after I got that feature from Luch. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Luch started talking to me about, you know what I'm saying, the BMIs and shit like that, and it started putting me on game about paperwork and shit like that because I knew, because bro, like, really told me, like, Luch was one of the first niggas who really, like, told me. At first, like, welcome down, I was just, right. just throw that shit out there, let's see what this shit do. But right. Luch was, like, one of the niggas who really made me understand, say, look, bro, like, bro, nigga, you can. You can be that nigga, you know what I'm saying? Like, right. for real though, like, bro, you can take this bitch, like, for real, my nigga, you be spitting, ain't this shit hot. Like, bro, going through my shit, like, through my mixtape, nigga, and posting songs that ain't nobody posting type shit, right. you feel me? Right. So I know, bro, listening, he like, nigga, right. keep that shit going, bro, but get your paperwork shit right. So I got all that shit right now. I've been fucking with niggas like Ricky made it, you know what I'm saying? He do a bunch of, like, Go Yeah Yo, Sauce Walker, Beto. Bunch of niggas, uh, bunch of niggas beat. He done done, he done done beats for a bunch of niggas in Texas, man. Little Mexican, he be breaking shit down though. Ricky right. made it. Uh, 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 Casey beats. I just did the one on an Afghanistan track that was done by Ellis Max. You know what I'm talking about? This Mexican chick. You know what I'm talking about? Okay. Man, all my beats lately like been done. Hey man, yeah. shout out to the Browns yeah. though. You yeah, know what I'm talking about? Squirt like, Benny, like, look. Me. Yeah, yeah that, that, shout out to the best days, bro. Hey, <laughs> bullshit, bro. Oh, really? bro, bro. Yeah, I hear some yeah. niggas. I heard yeah. a lot of niggas yeah. beats in the city, but I'm gonna yeah. tell you right now, boy. Them motherfucking, man, I don't know what it is with the mess ass right now, but they got some hot fucking shit, man. I got three Mexicans right now. Mexican boys that do my beats. Right. You know what I'm saying? I call them my three amigos. You know what I'm talking yeah. about? Square business. Yeah, you gonna right, get a right. hit out of one of them <laughs> motherfuckers. You know what I'm saying? Jay Stacks, uh, Ricky made it in case. You know what I'm talking about? Like I say, uh, now Afghanistan was done by this Mexican chick, man. Ella Smacks, man. And we tapped in on some other shit. She beasted that beat. 
You know what I'm saying? Oh, hey, so beasted man. that motherfucker. And I know you beasting that motherfucker too, shit. Yeah, yeah man, I tell man. that bitch, you know me, man. I'm a, <laughs> I'm gonna jump on that bitch, do my work. Nah, man, for now, nah, for real, for real, man. Like, so what? What, what, what you? What, what's uh? So what you got? What three projects that I told? Man, X Island still got two projects. Two. I, ain't, I ain't even dropped another project. I just been dropping singles. So that Afghanistan is finna be the yeah. Now Afghanistan. Now Afghanistan finna be the the new project. The new project. And like, how many tracks you dropping on this? One? It's gonna be an EP. I'm just finna throw the folks because I feel like I feel like you know what I'm saying. Niggas don't respect it when there's too many songs. Right. Mm -hmm. Right. So it's really just gonna be an EP. I probably put five songs on there real quick. And shoot a video to all of them and, and drop them spontaneously. You feel me? But besides that, I got uh I got a three single deal with BWAK, man. Shout out Artillery South, you know what I'm saying? Shout out Zaytoven, you know what I mean? We got a uh familiar ter territory, man. We got a three single deal, man. We got some big shit going on right now, you know what I mean? I'm finna shoot out there to Atlanta tomorrow. Right. You know what I mean? So it's a bunch of shit I've been having going. Me and Peach Head got the Make It Here video. That hoes gonna be on BT, Revolt TV. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna yeah, be Peach, posting the skills. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah, Prince when Real Life Street Stars, man. they dropping them videos there. Shout out Real Life Street Stars. Shout out, I see. Man, I yeah. appreciate them uh, tapping in, finally tapping in and fucking with yeah. me. You know uh, what I'm talking about? You know, because, you know, it was a bunch of other shit that was going on that right. we can't speak on. But, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, everybody growing up. You mm. feel what I'm saying? You right know, on. anything, you know what I mean, could be patched. You feel yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, all so I gotta do is respect it. They, uh, dropped, they dropped an Afghanistan video, man. Real respect, you know what I mean? Shout out to Rook, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And Joker, man. Solid dudes, bro, you know what I mean? Score Business, they dropped an Afghanistan yeah. video for me, you know what I mean? Making sure that I'm starting to get on their platform. Hopefully, I'll be sitting down with them soon, dog. Man, that's good, man. That's what I wanted to see, man, because I know when back then when I heard the word, I was just like, man, I already seen it. When the first day I heard the word and I seen your work, I was like, oh, yeah. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah, I say, it, yeah, it's a given. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Man. Cause, you know what I'm saying? Because it, it was pure. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So it's man. different when you're hungry. You know what I'm saying? Like I tell a nigga, when you get in this music and you're hungry, it's a difference. Yeah, you can. Yeah, man. You yeah. <laughs> hear it, man. Motherfucker, motherfucker you hear it in your voice. But not only just, some people be so hungry that they'll just jeopardize their whole, they, they ain't got no more. They just rap about anything. You right, right, right. Like, we hungry, but we, right. we still, I'm still going to do my music. Right. You know what I mean? Like, I ain't gonna do what you do because mm -hmm. I'm, I'm trying to get in the game. I'm gonna do what I do. Right. You feel what I'm saying? Man, I make people fuck. That's the difference. I make people fuck with my shit. A lot of you niggas be trying to be like the young niggas. You know what I'm saying? I make the young niggas want to be like, want to wanna look forward to growing up. You know right, what I mean? Right, so it right. be different. Right, right. You feel what I'm saying? I'm not, I'm not in Peach Head videos. Right. And them young niggas videos jumping around, dying, and right. waving guns, backpacks, all this shit. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like, I do my shit, everybody do their shit, but you know what I'm saying? I try to make people gravitate to my lifestyle. You know what I mean? It's a standard. Yeah, it's a standard. Yeah, it's a standard. I, and I'm glad you said that, because I think a lot of, a, some folks don't understand that, especially older folks, you know, like, they don't understand that you can do the same thing, you know, and you know, but it's a, it's a certain way that you do it. Yeah, man, that's why my music, I always drop some, 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 you know, some shit that people can relate to. I talk oh, about yeah. bills, I talk about my, you know, bill, you know what I mean? All of that shit, man, you know what I mean? Real life shit. You know what I mean? Cause squad business, sooner or later, we all going through it, bro. We all going through it, man. Yeah. Everybody ain't always jo joyful. You know, nah. niggas start calling me a conscious rapper for a second. You know what I mean? But I ain't no country. I mean, it ain't about that. It's not. It's, it's like, about nigga, truth. Like, like, nigga, it's truth. Nigga, it's like, nigga, look, look, nigga, this is what I, this is what I see. Yeah, this you know what I'm saying? What, this what, reality, this reality. what I'm supposed to say. You like, know what I'm saying? Like, 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 nigga, what you said, like, and that's the thing. What's wrong? I think that's what's wrong. Where I hear everybody, the stereotype is in here. Yeah, they try to put you in a box. Yeah, try to put you in a box. Uh, October go hard, but he kind of like on some country shit. Right, right. What the fuck? Look, I'm awesome. Nah, no, I mean, that's it, real life. I was always told I always break the box, you know what I'm saying? Get out yeah, of the box. Get out you know the box. You know what I'm saying? But then again, you know, me stepping out of the box and build big, uh, strong relationships with other people, man, right. because those same songs that niggas was calling me conscious for, you know what I'm saying, build my relationship with niggas like DLC. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's my nigga. You know what I'm saying? Like, shout out DLC. Shout out DLC, man. You know what I mean? Appreciate it, man. You know what I mean? Thanks for the uh, congratulations on the baby and all that. That's, that's my nigga. And that's a, that's a, that's a, like, that's, and, that's and like not, one of them. You know what yeah, I'm saying? And not just, yeah. and I ain't talking about like, oh, I'm fucking with DLC. DLC finna get me signed. Well, well, I'm nah, telling you that, it, I'm nothing. telling you that, bro, fuck with my music. Right. Like, he's yeah. a fan of my mm -hmm. music. That's all I'm saying. Right. Right. That nigga's a fan of my music. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? He liked that shit, that shit, the real shit. You feel right. what I'm saying? So, yeah, man, you know, 
That shit go a long way. That real shit to get you somewhere, bro. You know what I mean? You never know. These young niggas that they in the game, but these old niggas are making these gears moves. You know what I'm talking about? So, you know what I mean? You make an old nigga foot tap, bro. Some some shit gonna start generating around that. Right, right. You know what I mean? Yeah, man. That shit get the machine going, you know what I'm man. Saying? I'm and that's and that's and that's what it's about, man. For real. Yeah, and it's about it. the destruction. Yeah. And then I think that's what a lot of, you know, the young kids don't understand. It's like it's not a, yeah. ah, ah, it's a nigga, it's a it's structure. Bad. You know, it's a, it's a, what yeah, it's, a structure. it's a young nigga town, but an old nigga world. You yeah, know what I'm talking yeah. about? Believe that, mm -hmm. man. For real. Believe, Believe that. that. They gonna keep everything in line. Yeah, you know it's for business, man. No matter what you do, you know what I'm saying? He is a young, like I said, it's a young nigga town, but an old nigga world. Yeah, yeah, all down here up in your city doing this, doing that. But these niggas up in these high places, man. So, but you got some know? old niggas that just, you know, just just can't get right too. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's right. like it's a it's a it's a balance. You know what I'm saying? It's a balance. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's a balance. balance. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. So like. Like you were talking earlier about the the process of you move you go in Atlanta, you know, like okay, like who you know, I ain't trying to be all up in your business, How'd but it like, go? How'd like but like what's what's your process? Like I mean, like who who's supporting you? Like who's, who's able to, you know, structure up your daily routine of getting your shows, like no what's lie, up with man. the show, you got I the shows coming man. up. Any you know what I mean, check this out, man. Y'all tap in with me trouble two times, man, for sure, man. If you are a good manager in the city or whatever, man, if you serious about focusing on uh on what the fuck I got going on, right on. tap in with me, bro. Uh, but I've been doing my shit uh, so no, independent, hundred percent independent. Right, like, that's I, what's up. I record my shit in my living room. I make sure my own dates is scheduled. You know what I'm talking about? And uh, a big supporter though, big supporters lately. You know what I'm saying? Uh, for damn shout BWA Kane. You know what I'm saying? Really that's my bro. nigga. You know what I'm really saying? Bread with Kane. You know what I'm talking about? For real though, mm -hmm. solid nigga, bro. And the whole fam, y'all already know. You know what I mean? The whole family, you know what I mean? The whole nigga, everybody everywhere, bro. Shout out to y'all niggas, man, for showing love. You know what I'm saying? Bro, tapped in with me, bro, when I was at one of my lowest points. Right. You know what I'm saying? After the Mo 3 death and all of that bitch ass shit, I wasn't trying to rap or nothing. I was just on getting my paper and whatever's whatever. You know what I'm talking right. about? Uh, on some other shit, but, you know, he tapped in with me, man. I was on the block, man. It had got real rough for me. You know what I'm saying? I was back on the block doing what I was doing, you know what I mean? And, bro, Hit me on the FaceTime out the blue, you know what I'm saying? I ain't talked to him in over a year. And it was like, say, bro, we finna do this music shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, tap in with me. Like, that's when you was just like, okay, let's go. Let's, let's go. go. Blood, come on out. Right. I went out to Atlanta, man. I went out to uh, Houston with the brethren, you know what I mean? Just hit the road a couple times with them, you know what I mean? They they embraced me like family, like right. little bro, you know what I'm saying? Right. Like, for real, you know, not just like little bro, but like bro. Right. You feel what I'm saying? Right. So, you know, it just motivated me a, a whole different speed, you right. feel me? And then uh, doors that was open, you know what I mean? It's a bunch of shit I got going on that I don't even speak on, but right. definitely in the mix. Like, right. you know, already in the mix. I say, so you be going down there tapping in, getting yeah. in the studio, coming yeah, back, man. videos. I see, yeah, I, you keeping the videos. I see you keeping that structure going. Yeah, man, making yeah. sure the house ain't cheap, $200, $100 videos. <laughs> <laughs> you quality. keep in line, no, no, for real. Quality that, over quantity, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Quality yeah. over quantity, right. you know what I mean? A lot right. of niggas, you know, they were telling me, you know, they had these bullshit lists and shit going around, nigga tell me, the reason I wasn't higher on the list is because I didn't drop a lot. But then again, you know what I mean? I'm not into dropping a whole bunch of shit, boys. You know what I'm saying, right. bro? Like, mm -hmm. like man, that shit booling out, but you know what but I mean? I'm gonna tell you something about the list. really respect let me, let, let me, let, this is a man, single Let me, let me right tell you something about the list, because I'm gonna tell you something, because I'm gonna tell you, like, right now, in this, in this, in this right here, right? Yeah. right. Like, so, I made a list. Yeah. I mean, I got a whole list, but the list, See people say when I started seeing people listen, I seen how they was trying to you know put people in categories and yeah. in the box. So I started I started thinking. I said I'm gonna make a mediumatic list. Yeah. And what I did was I took every mm -hmm. artist from the '80s mm -hmm. to now. Yeah. And put them all on the list. Yeah. But when I kept posting my list, people were like, why well, ain't on the list? What? And then when I post the next list, and they see themselves on the list, and they be like. Oh yeah, that's what's up. I yeah, like. I already like, you know how it go. That list shit, man. That shit build a bunch of bad blood. I would stay it, off of that. And I see that. And, yeah. and I see that. And I, I recognize that. Stay away from and I, and I see that. And I was like, I and I said, and I had to tell people like, because nah, it's this. un, it's un, it's unfortunately it's right. Because it's like this, the niggas that you fuck with personally, you hear their music more anyway. Mm -hmm. 
You right. know what I'm saying? So I know what your music is. Right. It might be a nigga you don't really just fuck with like that, but you don't heard his music. Right. You feel what I'm saying? Right. But, you, know, you know what I mean? It just be a, and then relationships and shit like that. But you know, I tell them niggas like that. I tell them everybody, man, just keep me out them list, man. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> it's bull, bro. Like I, I just don't want to be on the list. Right. Man. Right. You know what right. I'm saying? Right. Like because it's like you know what I mean? It's just too much going on. Then I be feeling some type of way because some nigga be whacked in the bitch. I don't give a fuck. I said. And then I don't want to have to say it. You know what I'm saying? So keep me off the list, man. <laughs> nah, that's when that's not. Nah, nah, that's when that's when your mom tell me, man, tell that boy he can't rap. You hear me? Nah, tell that nigga not telling you something. Y'all playing around here. You, you know, know what I'm saying? saying? Somebody gotta tell him. You know what I'm saying? Somebody gotta tell him. You might definitely gotta tell these niggas. <laughs> but then again, what you, but then again, y'all niggas, y'all niggas ain't real friends. Y'all let y'all partners waste all this money, man. Man, mm -hmm. say spending all this goddamn money. Sometimes, hey, I, I done been in a situation. When I done told niggas, you niggas know, don't want to but, but nigga, they, they, hey, but then again, say, you know what I'm saying? Hey, hey, hey man, shit, hey, say, I, JJ Fish got some money, man. man say, shit. hey, that nigga getting paid, man. I done seen, man, I done seen, man, overseas, they ain't saying, hey, man, they got a million, it's really about marketing. It's really about marketing. The game now is really about marketing and promotion, so that's why I don't never tell a nigga he suck no more. Right. Because it's a million motherfuckers who gonna like that bitch. Right. It's a billions and billions of people in this world, man. You can get a million motherfucking diehard fans from anybody. Man, man like, anybody, Lord. bro. Man, what man? Anybody. What was that nigga from Atlanta named God? What was that nigga? Uh, Look, Charleston yeah. White. Yeah. Yeah. God or something Charles, yeah. niggas, 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 niggas be bashing Charleston White shit like that. I don't fuck with them neither. But I'm gonna tell you this right here. Charleston White got diehard fans. Uh -huh. You know why? Because he was able to reach people of like minds. Right. right. If you put them big, if you put me out there to uh, five hundred thousand people. Move you feel in. what I'm saying? 50,000 of those right. people right. don't think like me. Mm -hmm. So if I make them, if they if they just be diehard and then I say out of them 50,000, 20 of them be coke followers. Oh, yeah. Want to click on everything you post. Hey. Nigga, that's <laughs> motherfucking, them comments will take you there, man. You yeah. know what I mean? All you got, it's about marketing, bro. So if your yeah. shit is trash, market that shit. You know what I'm <laughs> <laughs> You know what I'm saying? And I, okay. No, Market shit. that shit, man. Yeah. It's a million okay. motherfuckers hey, like that. Hey, gonna say on Instagram sponsored by okay. Audio. Yeah, no, 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 Instagram no. sponsored by Audio. Yeah, <laughs> <in> that <laughs> shit, man. Get that shit out there, man. It's gonna be. It's a million motherfuckers like that shit. Believe it, bro. Who are business, man? And that'll get you there, nigga. You motherfucking a public figure just off that. Oh, man. So, man, what you grow up listening to? Like, man, what, man, what was you on, man? man. Man, I was, you know what I'm saying? I was, <laughs> unfortunately, man, I was on fucking Luchi Pookie off the rip. You okay, know what I'm saying? You know but that, that wasn't my jump off niggas that made me want to rap. Right. You know what I'm saying? My jump off, my mama a diehard Pac fan. Mm -hmm. Score bitches, you know what I mean? Score bitches, you know, my mama was locked up. You feel me? So, her, she was, you know what I mean? My mama was locked up as I was right. So, her being so diehard Pac fan, then me hearing Pac, you know what I'm saying, growing up there, mama, you know what I'm talking about? All that hugging on your mama from the jail cell, all that shit. Pac was yeah. the biggest motivation to start yeah. rapping, you know what I'm saying? Because, you know, having to take them trips down that freeway, going to see my mama come out in the TDC whites yeah. nigga, for years, you know what I'm yeah. saying? My mama was locked up eight years, nigga, you know, from when I was three all the way to I was 11. Then I told you when I was 13, I did the juvenile life sentence. So, 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 you, so that we, unit, that another gap. Most of us, most of our time together, bro, for 18 was through correctional institutions. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So, you know what I mean? Like, hell yeah, bro. It's real shit. Like, I fuck with Pac. Then I got I'm on good, some fucking man. Jay Z, man. My kid folk had a Jay Z, mm -hmm. my nigga, Reasonable Doubt album. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Ooh. I had that help. I was and on they said Jay Z. That's bro, a reasonable doubt, bro. Bro. I they had a reasonable doubt it. album, nigga. Yeah. I had never heard listen to me. I had heard Jay Z. Uh -huh. But my kinfolk left the C D, bro. I was probably like in third grade. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I had the fucking pop greatest hits that my uncle had gave me because every time I jumped in his car, I make him put it in. that brown bitch. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm yeah, talking yeah, about? Yeah, 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 man. Every time I jump my uncle's car, man, I tell him, I, I make him put that hoe in. I say, what a pop CD? Yeah. We put that bitch in tub where he was like, man, you you want that CD, man? You can have it, bro. Yeah. This nigga, I, <laughs> boy, I was astounded. Nigga, I'll never forget this excitement in my heart, nigga, the day my cousin gave me, my uncle gave me that pop CD. Boom. Then my other cousin left for 
left the motherfucking reasonable doubt. So I'm listening to reasonable doubt. Pop. Reasonable doubt. Pop grants the greatest hits. These motherfuckers is really, I'm not knowing this kid. They building my vocabulary so stupid. I had a rap, I was rapping in third grade. Like, I had motherfucking, I was spitting though. Right, right, you know what right, I mean? Right. Square business, man. I had motherfuckers trying to get me on their little <coughs> record labels and shit then. But uh, that shit, that then shit. Lucha and Pookie had the nerve to come out, man. Then yeah. you hearing these niggas spit, you know what I'm saying, yeah. on the radio with, with some lyrics that was stupid, bro. Like, so all of my motherfucking, my niggas was like, lyrics is, everybody that I jam growing up was lyrics. These was my, these was my favorite artists, Lucha, Pookie, Pop, and, uh, and Jay-Z. Okay, all right. But Jay-Z is reasonable doubt. Jay Z reasonable doubt. Okay, that was the, yeah, that was the, that was the first one. Okay. Then the uh that Sean that, Carter that, 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 like that, 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 that was that was for, that was for the dynasty one. Yeah, 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 yeah. All of that shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that nigga was killing shit. Man, man. all right. He, no. <laughs> so all of them took me at two four back. Nah, for real, you know. We threw, we threw, we threw, we threw, yeah, yeah. We say we start wars. They so, threw three. Yeah, I don't know. Man. So, yeah, so, so, man, you got any features on this on this album? Man, I got me and No Flaw Peach on this one, man. Okay, it's probably gonna be like, I ain't gonna stunt. Like, I got some. I got a major feature coming, but you know, uh, the person that I wanted to do it, man. You know, what I'm saying he might still do it, but it's like I don't know, man. You know what I mean? I'm, I'm, I ain't gonna put who out there that I'm gonna get on this night. Right, okay, but gonna it's definitely gonna be somebody. Right. It's gonna be somebody. I got some major features coming, uh -huh. but uh, I had to sit back, man, and re revamp shit. You know what I mean? I don't right. know who hot, man. I don't listen but, to nobody, bro. But, but, so I have to take advice from us. Okay, like so, okay. Let's put it like this, then. All right, who you always wanted to work with or want to do a feature with? You know what I'm saying? Man, I ain't gonna bullshit. Do a feature with? Oh yeah, do a song or do, or do a chomp do song, a song with together. Man, with. I ain't gonna bullshit. I always wanted to do a song with Kendrick Lamar. You know what I'm saying? Ooh. But nigga, no bullshit. Ooh, like fuck the bullshit. Or, or J Rock or some shit. You know what I'm saying? J Rock, Kendrick Lamar, them niggas right there. You know what I'm saying? But as far as like gangs, I like them niggas on a different level, like they lyrics and shit. But you know, I don't really know no too many niggas that I just say, "Hey, bro, I just want to do a feature with." Like none of these niggas is like, you know what I mean? I mean, shit. I do a, I like a Gates Boo, Gates Boo, Mozzie Boo. You know what I'm saying? Mozzie, Gates right. Boo, uh, Boosie Boo. Uh, it's a bunch of you know what I'm saying niggas that I fuck with. You know what I right. mean? But you know what I mean? I ain't just like. I would have to hear the song. <laughs> you feel me? I would have right. to make the song and say, right. God right. damn, I hear what's right. going right. on. Right. So right. you know right. how right. that like, shit yeah, go. Okay. You like they buy, like, yeah, I got to buy that shit. Like, damn, yeah, this yeah, sound like, yeah. nigga, yeah. We need to get yeah. your money back. Y'all yeah. on this house, yeah. you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Or, or, you know, some shit like that. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Nah, I can, I can respect that. I can respect that. Yeah, but we definitely trying to, you definitely tapping in, man. You know, I fuck with her. We all be doing too many features around around local right. and shit. You know what I mean? I got some shit on that bitch. I got a song that oh yeah. I'ma drop uh the track. I got Peach Head so far and I got Fat Pimp. Me and Fat Pimp got a track that's okay, gonna be on. Shout out Fat Pimp. Shout out Fat Pimp. Fat Pimp got Pimp gonna be on this yeah. motherfucker. Man, that's what's up. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. There we you go. Know what I'm saying? Yeah. Shout out Fat Pimp. There we go. Yeah, all man. That's what's up. You're a real solid nigga too. You know what I'm saying? From nah, the knock to the blip, man, it's, you know what I mean? It's really still, you know what I mean? It's girl business. Nah, know? that's respect. Nah, fuck that, with Brody. Yeah. You know what I mean? I fuck with a lot of Cliff niggas too. Yeah. Nah, that's what's up. I saw, I saw you be moving around then. Man, I'm all through the thing. Okay, all right. You know what I'm saying? You know, that's, why, that's why I know I had to tap in. You know, know what I'm saying? I'm all through the thing, man. The city, I love the city, man. The city love me, man. You know, right. I, don't, I don't really participate in all that uh, bullshit shenanigans nah. niggas be having going on, you feel me? I be really standing on my own, you know what I mean? Nah, we do a nigga every day, we gonna check it at the dope shit. Hell yeah, you, you know, know what I'm saying? saying? Like, that's the real shit. You know, real niggas in Dallas gonna always connect, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? And shit, and so when you start, yeah. so once you connect and you start doing all that, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Man, then you, you already know. know. <laughs> a lot of niggas be hanging out and having a lot of shit. You already know, shit, shit. Baby. Because I'm known and I fuck with a lot of niggas. Like, I fuck with the North period. Like, nah, niggas be I on fuck money, with man. The North period, man. You know what I'm saying? Squad business. Yeah. So, we definitely gonna get behind my niggas. Yeah. All of them. I support Peach Head shit. I support yeah. fucking Mooney shit. Oh, uh, shout out Mooney. I, I like Mooney. Them you know niggas know is man. the ones, like, them niggas, they're going hard in the C bitch. C Fat, C -fat Mooney yeah. 900, No Flop Peach, uh, a Quick Trip over there, AOF Key, you know what I'm saying? CBG Block, 
You know what I'm saying? It's a bunch of niggas out in the north that I've been fucking with. Uh, that's going hard, nigga, from Hampton Park. You know what I'm saying? To the crook. You know what I mean? Like for real, and I like really trying to put on for this bitch. You know what I mean? And I feel like putting on for it the right way. You know what I mean? I know what you mean. Especially Mooney and, and Peach. Yeah. Especially Mooney and Peach, man. I need to get them niggas on one track real quick. You know what I'm saying? Oh yeah, that's gonna be fire. You know what I'm saying? That's, that's definitely gonna be live. You know what I'm saying? To turn up. So man, what's, so before we get up out of here, I would ask. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying, a couple questions and stuff like that. So I want to ask these three questions right here. My first question is, what's your top three strands, strands of weed you like to smoke? Man, that would be. Cause we gonna keep it lit. Hmm. My favorite, my favorite strand, but it gotta be the right shit. It gotta, they can't play with it. It gotta be. I like glue, man, like a motherfucker. Mm -hmm. You like that glue? Yeah, I love glue, glue man. What, like, the foe or just the glue? The glue, gorilla okay. glue. If it's done right, man. If mm -hmm. it's that real glue, mm -hmm. real deal, gorilla glue, like because it was like one of the first Zy strands that was just coming, like. You know what I'm saying? That I was fucking with like, damn, this shit here's some smash. Like I got that shit back, back way back before niggas was on it. I was smoking it. Cause yeah. I lived in Colorado. Uh, but uh, that man that GP, I fuck with the Gary Payton all day. You know what I'm saying? That Gary mm, Payton. You like that? You like the Gary man, Payton? Man, that GP, man, that shit's a man. That shit be hitting, bro. I don't I know, man. man. He keep telling he me that. He keep telling me that, man. Like, I be like, like, man. Say, be careful. These yeah. niggas yeah. play with the pack. Yeah. Like, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Yeah. If you get that real deal, GP man, yeah. that Gary Payne smoking like a motherfucker. Oh <laughs> uh, shit! You know, uh, all the gel gelato, hey, the gelato. Oh yeah, yeah, I gelato, like it. Yeah, like, I, I, can fuck, I can fuck with that gelato. But I, I be, I smoke a bunch of shit, bro. I be mm. smoking a lot of Zaz and shit like yeah. that, niggas. And then you know, niggas be feeling me. It's trying to put me on. Yeah, they don't up the eye on it now. Yeah. When they nah, don't put the eye on it, man. That Zai, that Zai yeah. just mean that your yeah, shit ain't just you a normal mean, strand yeah, from yeah, back in the day. You know, know what I'm saying? It's something like like glue. Like niggas don't, some niggas don't even consider like gorilla glue Zai. Right. You right, know what I mean? Right. Because it's, you know what I mean? Because it's old right, or whatever. Right. You know what I mean? Them new shits like the cookies and shit like that. That's what niggas is. All of them backpack boys and all of that shit. You know what I mean? That good shit. But a lot of these niggas are pack faking. So I'll be careful. <laughs> What's your top three? Your top three? Your top three rappers of all time? Top three rappers of all fucking time. Man, that's hard to bitch. I should have knew this question was coming. Yeah, that's, really, that, that's going down, man. Man, man off the oh, rip, nigga. Off the down. rip. Fuck what a nigga talking about, man. And you know what I'm saying? It might be because of these brothers or gone, but now nah, it's how they influence my life. Is you know what I mean? I'm gonna give the first off the rip. My nigga is gonna get to Pac. Mm -hmm. The second one is gonna go to PMC. Mm -hmm. hey, and the third mm -hmm. one, the third one, I'm gonna get a nil. Yeah. Man, yeah. Take it how they want to. Man, mm -hmm. these people are impacts on my life. You feel what I'm saying? Pac impact me growing up as Man. a child. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, Pimp C was my a uh, heavy, heavy influence right. on my my teenage and the fresh getting out of TYC was what I was chanting, you know what I'm saying? All the way, you know what I mean? So Pimp was Pimp was then and then Nip. Nip, you know what I mean? I bought my first house jamming Nip. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. I did it, man. Crenshaw album. Even before then I was, you know what I'm saying, on them. But you know what I mean? For you know what I mean? Square bit is nip, 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 nip is Nah, for real. I ain't no, nah, I ain't no respect. jump on Nip Finn nah, after he did and shit like that. I'm talking about now nah, for real. Nah, that's like respect. motivated me on a different level to see things bigger. You know what I'm saying? To 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 really want it. Like you can, you know what I mean? Like you can really obtain this shit. Like Nip was like a motherfucking like you know about you know affirmations, nigga. Yeah, like niggas yeah. damn affirmations nah, and I shit. Believe that shit. Uh, Nip that was shit. an affirm uh, uh, affirmation, bro. Every morning. Motivating me to go get this money to right. go obtain this house, man. To get this car, man. How to how to manage your money? I learned a lot of shit. You know what I'm saying about finances, not through him, but by him motivating me to go learn about it. You know what I'm saying? It's yeah, yeah. Like, yo, he didn't teach me this, but yeah. it was just some a, a nigga the, said it. It's a guy. You, know, know, like, you, jam, you can't jam this point in the right direction. Point me in the right, right direction, right. nigga. This is what it's about. You know what I'm saying? That go away. You know what I'm saying? Shit like that. You know what I mean? Yeah, man, that's what's up, man. That's why. That's why I say, nah, for real. I already knew. Yeah, I was intelligent when I when I met him. When we went down to the Lucha, uh, Lucha release. You know what I'm saying? Album release. You know what I'm saying? 
Not real. And I, we was chopping it up. I already knew then. I was like, yeah, I got to get him on the platform. Because I like, man, where you see yourself, man? Like, for real. Where you see yourself in five years? Man. Nah, for real. Where you see yourself in five years? Because I see you talking about information and things like that. And that's like, and that's what a lot of people don't understand, man. When you set things in order, you know what I'm saying? That structure, like we were talking about, that structure. Hey, man, you know, if I can do what I do the right way, man, you know what I'm talking about, you know. Like I say, man, you know, five years is a long time, man. You know what I mean? I'll just keep it 100. Five years is a long fucking time. Man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? We just trying to, I'm just trying to make it day by day. You know what I'm talking about? Right. I'm just being honest. So, you know what I'm saying? I'm hoping by the, I, I can see my, I can see what I can do six months from now. I can see what I can do right. eight months from now, but five years from now, who knows, bro? You know what I'm saying? I'm hoping it'd be a, a, in a better spot. You know what I'm saying? But right. you know, you know, I'm trying to I'm trying to get my shit going, you know what I mean? I'm trying to get my shit going, you know what I mean? Dallas is a real hating ass city. You know right. what I'm saying? So it's hard to predict where you'll be in five years rapping in Dallas. You know what I'm talking about? Square business, no, right. no cap. Right. You know what I mean? Bullshit aside, fuck with these rap niggas that tell you right. this shit real out here. Right. You know what I mean? Real shit. This shit real out here. Especially as you go and you start stepping up, you know what I mean? Like right. niggas better. It'd be best. It'd be best for rap niggas in Dallas, you know what I'm saying, not to flee the city. Don't flee nowhere, you know what I'm saying? But you know, duck out, get to your music, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? Square business because as you get bigger, like the hatred is the hatred gon' this is waiting for you, nigga. It's a cake yeah. I already baked. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? That's Square that business, thing. you know what I mean? <laughs> While you over there struggling and to get on, nigga. This shit been here all day waiting on you. It's right. been here. Right. 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 Come on right. in here, right. man. Yeah, get on. You waiting in line to get in the door. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> man, hey, it's on the table, bro. They finna serve you that. You know what I'm talking about? So, niggas is, you know, that Mo3 effect, bro. Mo3 effect, whatever the fuck you want to call it. Niggas, I ain't talking about the Mo3 and Trap Boy D for whatever, but I'm saying the Mo3 effect is as you go uh, higher, the hatred right. will come. The They'll betrayal. come from everywhere, right. bro. Mm -hmm. Like the betrayals, blood. Like the motherfuckers will see you, you know what I'm saying, rising up. Like they gonna, they'll gonna try to take you down. Niggas will feel like, you know what I'm saying, stomping on you right. is the way to get to another nigga. Nigga will feel like stomping on you is the way to get up. Like it's real out here, you know what I'm saying? Like for <laughs> real though, Dallas is one of them cities, nigga. Like if you a rapper out here, nigga, you better be on your shit. Right. Not no, I ain't talking about them. I ain't talking about none of them old ass niggas. You know what I'm saying? This ain't that boogie era. Right, right. <sighs> I'm dead serious. You know what I'm saying? This yeah. ain't that blood. This, this, this. I feel like, but this ain't no, that. But you era, know man. what I'm saying? Real, but I know that boogie era was forced. Yeah. That book, and I like I tell people that boogie era was forced. You know what I'm saying? No, I'm, I'm just saying though. Yeah. I'm not even talking about the and, vibe of the city. I'm yeah, talking about the, the energy the, of uh, the artists. artists. Okay. Towards each other, right, 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 right. You know what I'm saying? That was some unity ass shit. That was so, some. So what you feel? So what you feel? What you feel like the state of? Okay, because I see, because you say Dallas fucked up, and and you know, and it's like, like you say, you know, niggas ain't blind to it. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Niggas ain't blind to it. To right. You know, yeah, but at, at, at the end of the day, mm -hmm. what is it? What, what what does it? What does it really take? You know what I'm saying? Shit, man, the city fucked up. It's right. gonna be fucked up. It's gonna be fucked up. This the and they say, This Dallas in the '90s. Now that's what I told people mm -hmm. a long time ago. Now, now check this out, mm -hmm. because now, nah, now for real, I was telling people a long time ago. People don't understand why they, why they, why they even. Because one time before it, it wasn't triple D. You know what I'm saying? It was, it was dirty. Deep. Yeah, it was dirty, 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 dirty. That's what I call it, the dirty, dirty D. You know dirty, what I'm saying? Dirty, dirty it was a dirty, dirty Dallas. You yeah, know what I'm saying? That's what I call it. Still, I saw that's what uh, Triple D stood for. That's dirty, what dirty, it do stand Dallas. for. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But a nigga, you know, you know, at one point in time during the 2000s, you know, they, you know, flipping, they you know, flipping, you know, they flipped, flipped it, you know, you know, yeah, 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 Triple D, you know, 3D, you yeah. know what I'm saying? And I understand that shit, and that shit player. You know what I'm saying? But this ain't, this ain't that era, man. But, this ain't that. This ain't, I, <laughs> this ain't, man. Say, <laughs> hey, this ain't that ever, man. Be careful out here in these streets, man. I've been wrapping up in the D, man. If you ain't about what you're talking about, man, shit. Y'all see what's going on. You know what I'm saying? Y'all see what's going on, man. You know what I'm saying? To be told, is is most dangerous anywhere. Yeah, it's dangerous everywhere, but you know. So do you know what I mean? That rap shit, that rap shit get real, boy. You know what I'm saying? Niggas for real. Right. You know what I mean? Even just living in a D anyway, though. But that rap shit, that rap shit getting real yeah, in the yeah, motherfucker. And it separate shit right now. And it separate shit. You yeah. know what I'm saying? It separate shit, man. Because it's like this. That rap shit fucked up Atlanta. Yeah. 
Niggas don't know it though. Because they don't move around and they only see what's on TV, my right. nigga. You know what I'm saying? But niggas who in the street. Yeah, Atlanta niggas who in the streets, nigga. Say Atlanta man. Fucked out. Atlanta is fucked out. Rap rap destroying Atlanta. What? Man, I tell you, man, I went through Atlanta, man. I'm talking about nigga everything. Yeah, you know, why like, niggas thinking but, it's funny. Like but, like it, niggas think them niggas like what you see on TV, you would man. think niggas just kicking it up in the fucking man. in the ATL. You hear me pool parties and man. nigga nigga rap destroyed Atlanta. Nigga, them niggas over there worn it out out there. I, I ain't gonna say who won it out, but they worn it out, man, with rap. No. Rap beef. You know, you know what I'm saying? That's why these rappers is going to jail. Atlanta niggas is, is locked up, man. That shit is rap beef, man. You know what I'm saying? And it's gonna do what it's gonna do, but and it, what it was formed it, to do. But like we were saying, you feel me? Yeah. Like, like the, the demonstration yeah. in Chicago. It was this what is. You know what I'm saying? This is what it was formed to do. Like the new generation of rap. This is what it's gonna do. It's gonna destroy your. I like city. you said at that point. That's what rap. That's what they stirred the rap music. Yeah, that's what it's gonna do. And, it's that's, what it, to and do. that's what it did. Yeah. It, it, it tele, a television. You know what I'm saying? Programmed us exactly. Yeah, you know then, what I'm saying? Then not to mention all these. Guns, like, right. you know what I'm saying? Come on, now. What do you think we get? Come on, baby. You really, now that's why I was telling niggas, do you think niggas just, oh, like, 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 niggas just, oh, yeah, we just went to a whole boat, nigga, we just passed now. Nah, man, man ain't this us. Shit, we, wow. we ain't got that. We, nigga, we, this shit just popped up. Like, yeah, shit just laying down. Nigga, oh, like, God, like, think about when we was growing up, nigga, you had like a deuce five with the clip missing. You know what I'm saying? 380 and shit like that. These little niggas, as far as guns, as fucking Glocks with 30s. And these motherfuckers, nigga, we ain't never seen this many choppers on the street. A chopper to us, when we was growing up, was like a 308. You know what I'm saying? saying? Like, we from the slide. Uh, ooh, on or Uzi or T. Nah, squirt this shit. Like, what the fuck? This is an SK. Yeah, yeah, SK is. We got the choppers. We got the choppers. We got the choppers. We got the choppers. We got We got the choppers. We been yeah, nigga come out with the whole 308, nigga ready to take down the truck. Well, I knew well, I it was the top of When they start getting submachine oh, shit, yeah. started folding and shit like that, yeah, nigga started having the scope shit. and the shit, nigga, I was just yeah, like, I, say, yo, I was like, yeah. yeah don't you know think that ain't about design. Mm -hmm. yeah, don't man. think these young niggas ain't in these, these, young, these guns just popped up. We yeah. went, hey, listen to me, we couldn't have made a video <laughs> like that, <laughs> them niggas ain't. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It was yeah. impossible. We can't have that many guns. It was like three guns, and we all used them. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? What the whole part rusted in them yeah, niggas? Yeah, 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 Bitch, if we catch you with this hoe, your ass in trouble. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? The niggas not trying to shoot For real, yeah. they were running in the hot box, nigga. We was squirrel box. your ass down bad. <laughs> nigga, you have to go <laughs> run to your partner, nigga. What the fuck? What if we ain't here? No, where the three eighty nigga? We be riding these. Everybody had a three eighty. Who gonna shoot it? I'm gonna shoot it, nigga. Man, oh god! Man. If you in Dallas, you ain't had no three eighty, no dude, dude, nigga. Ah, Dubai. What was you? You know what I'm saying? You were not in the trenches, bro. You were not, man. Nigga, you ain't from Dallas, nigga. You ain't had no motherfucking high point, nigga. No god in that shit, nigga. I first gun. I said, hey, notice I said R. R gun. R first gun. R first gun. Yeah. Our first gun was a deuce five with the clip missing, nigga. We stuff in our dime section. Oh, yeah, you yeah, know yeah, that? yeah, yeah. Put one bullet at the top, nigga. Put the second in there. It's just how it's gonna say. Ain't putting no clip in that motherfucker. We had one bullet in that bitch. Nah, man. for real, man. Nigga, don't get it. Is, man. You know what I'm saying? Don't get caught with it. You know what I'm saying? And that's the thing, man. It's like, it's so fucked up how our city's so fucked up. But nigga, love our city, though, because you know, it's a nah, beautiful time. Love that we my city, having, man. And this motherfucker, because I remember plenty of times. Nigga, we get on the block, nigga. We get the rap, nigga. We need to go over. What first thing we go to, nigga, to the wash tier, nigga. No, for real, no. Nigga, shit on the out of mail room somewhere, yeah, nigga, man. shit, and them, fuck that yeah, whole world. That's how, that's yeah. where niggas learned how to rap it. Yeah. That's where me and Will know was it. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Up in Sun Colony, man, we up with that nigga beating on the nigga's car. Yeah. Train stations, like, on the you green know? box, you nigga, yeah, on the green man, box, you know nigga, shit. That dark train, yeah. nigga, from the movies man. and shit. Like, niggas was out there, you know what I'm saying? Like, for real, like, we was doing that before the dark train before the nigga dark yeah, train even went shit. to the north. Yeah, for you know, real. The bitch wasn't even in the Oak Cliff. Bitch that bitch wasn't even on Lake Street. Yeah, or, you know what I'm saying? Yo, when that shit, when they building that shit, nigga, I remember when that shit first, yeah, when that dark came, nigga, all the niggas was on that, nigga. We were everywhere, nigga. 
where a nigga rapping and where nigga you get the off the bus, nigga everybody up. rapping. Look, you can you can do your shit if you knew how to. You know, we knew yeah. how them the bus stations back in the day. Yeah, we had, uh -huh, yeah. They got train stations now. We had bus stations. Yeah, you know what yeah. yeah, we had the bus stations. Yeah, yeah. all the buses yeah. be right yeah. here. Nigga, ain't no yeah. train yeah. coming yeah. through this house. You gotta go all the way downtown on the bus to go wherever you trying to go. If you want to in the wrong spot, nigga, get your ass beat. You know, for real, that's back when niggas was killing. That's oh, yeah. back when niggas would kick your ass, though. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Nigga, yeah, nigga now niggas will smoke you. Yeah, nigga you know smoke. what I'm saying? Nigga will run down yeah. on you, nigga. What? You know what? Yeah, Mop mm -hmm. your ass, nigga. You know what I mean? But With the quickness. When we was young, niggas would run down and beat the shit out you. You have to fight. You might knock a couple niggas out, too. You might be able to tell the story. Mm -hmm. yeah, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. yeah. Business, you yeah. know? Mm -hmm. Scrub yeah, we say what, what the niggas say on Friday and today. Say you, you, you live to see another day. Yeah, you live to see another day. You live to see another day, goddammit. I think the guns just, you know what I'm saying? Like the guns back in the day, we was using them. It got real, real quick though. I ain't gonna stunt, you know. It went, we we didn't have a long childhood of fun and shit. It, it got real fast. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm yeah. saying? You know, it got real, real fast. Not real, because when you a kid and you don't really know what side you from, you know what side you from, but you don't know. You don't know. Look, check this out. All right, in elementary and in junior high, you just know you like. We just knew we was from. We just banging the knob, right. but we banged our streets. Right, right, right. But we right. didn't know what our streets really meant. We didn't right. really understand that we got all. Oh, the niggas who had been beefing with niggas from that street. From all and now time. you all us, we cool, we just elementary. These niggas from the other street, you know what I'm saying? They mm -hmm. they just saying we don't they don't understand, yeah, we bro. And all but then you get shit. all this, then you start realizing, oh, this is a lot of this my hood. Like, oh, that's they hood. Like, oh, he riding with like the toughest niggas. Y'all gonna everything gonna separate, like the throatest niggas, the hustlers, they gonna get in the car with the big homies from over here. They gonna roll by, they might see the nigga you was cool with and y'all play best by with, he in the car with the other nigga big homie, with the big homie that your yeah, big homie yeah, beefing with. Yeah, yeah. You like, damn. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And there it go. There it go. Yeah. You there feel what I'm go. saying? And there it and go. That's you know the what divide mean? in our city right now. Yeah, man, like you can inherit, it's called <coughs> inheriting beef. You yeah. know what I'm talking about, square business, even with this rap shit. Like, that's why I say it destroys city because you got to inherit, you will inherit beef. Yeah. You feel what I'm saying? Because a motherfucker, like, you could be so close to a nigga. Like, say, uh, yeah. you can be close to a nigga, bro, who close to a nigga who gets smoked. Yeah. You feel what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Now, yo nigga that you close to tripping. You feel what I'm saying? You ain't involved, but what if your nigga gets smoked? Yeah, and then... It's... That's that domino effect. You feel what I'm saying? That domino effect. Oh, you know what I'm saying? Oh. You like, you like, you like, that ain't my beef. That's, that's, uh, right now, you nigga be like, nah, that ain't my beef. That's bro partner beef. But now bro them took his shit up in there. Now I'm looking at bro like, bro, you know we riding down for each other. Mm -hmm. So boom, you sitting back like, y'all, you don't want to get, but then they smoke you. Ah, oh, fuck. Man, now I'm at your you shit. Fuck. Now you fuck. It's called inheriting beef, blood. That's what. That's why rap beef is fuck. destroying mm -hmm. cities because beef is being inherited. Because ain't nobody going to stand there and let Something you smoke. Like you just watch him smoke him. He, now he just smoked your pot. You ain't finna let watch no nigga make no this track about, about your dead homies. fuck with a lot of niggas. Yeah, like, niggas sometimes you fuck with a nigga and you realize like, boom, you be like, oh damn, whoop, whoop, yeah. kill a nigga daddy, whoop, whoop, and he, you cool, what's yeah, like? Yeah, like weird. It's like, a bunch whoop, of shit like. Or like how old boy, like I'm like, damn, oh nigga, you fuck with a nigga that set me up and sent me to the pen, right. but you cool with this nigga, but you come around me, and yo, you never know, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you can hear like, it beef, man. And that real, not for real. Yeah, man. Nah, just by being away, bro. You can yeah. being around, bro. Like you know what I mean? Motherfucker could assume you. Yeah. Motherfucker, you know what I mean? Motherfucker, could, you know what I mean? So you know, like I say, man, that rap shit is, you know, this rap beef shit is designed to destroy cities. It's gonna destroy cities, bro. And he's gonna do his work out here too. Right. You know what I'm saying? But a nigga gotta boss up. Everybody need to boss up. You know what I mean? Right. Like, my advice for the Dallas rappers, my nigga, boss the fuck up. Like it's time to start. You know what I'm saying? Venturing and now to start doing bigger shit. You know right. what I mean? That's how them Chicago niggas survived they, they music in their city. They, right, bossed, they bossed up. up. They understood. They, they understand understood that. that, okay, well, we can't do shows in the city. Right. You know what I'm saying? Because it's going to be this. You right. know what I'm saying? So, boom. Now, that's fucked up for the city. 
Right. But it's good that ain't nobody got their ass smoked. Right. You know what I'm right. saying? Square business. You know what I mean? Right. Like, Dirk and them don't do shows and shit. Them niggas don't do shows. Right. I love being fucking Chicago. Yeah, no, no, no. They done shut that down. They shut that shit down because, so you know, it's, it's, you know what I mean? So, y'all just got to boss up, bro. You know what I mean? A lot of that shit, my nigga, you know what I mean? Niggas just got to stop fanning flames on a lot of shit, too. You know what I mean? A lot of niggas be fanning flames on shit. Right. You feel me? Right. You know what I mean? A lot of these bloggers and shit like that, my nigga, you know what I mean? They put out these false narratives and they'll, they'll turn a the nigga up and really get people hurt. They don't even know that they fucking with. Uh, uh, yeah, like, like, bro, like, for real, y'all don't even understand. Like, you know what I mean? Like, nigga, some niggas, some niggas gonna live or die by their reputation, period. Right. Period, my right. nigga. So, so it ain't no need some, for you to highlight Yeah, it. don't make a nigga. Don't highlight the motherfucker, you know yeah, what I'm saying? like, don't make a nigga, bro. <laughs> yeah, bro. Not, not that real, real, not that real shit. Because now, you got, not even a nigga, not even a nigga, you got niggas who, who that nigga nigga. Right. You got niggas, right. you know what I'm saying? You got niggas who will ride or die for me. Right. You know what I'm saying? Squad mm -hmm. business, like for real. Not just off my name and know who the fuck I am, know what the fuck they don't call, know what I done did for them. Right. You know what I'm talking about? Just the fact that you spitting on a nigga. You know what I'm saying? Squad business. Nigga get a nigga walk down, one of my niggas will throw their life away. Right. Because of you. You know what I'm talking about? you're not respecting the artist. Yeah, you ain't respecting you, no, no, you're not respecting no, no, no matter what the artist's talking about. Yeah. But you're not, you still not respecting the artist. You, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? Because like at the end of the day, it's like, man, this nigga dropping music. Yeah, man. No right. matter what the fact, what he's talking about. Man, at the end of the day. Play the jam, man. <laughs> you know what I mean? You know what I mean? No. For real, no. no. For real. You know what I'm saying? Like, like shit. Yeah, man. Like, you like, know what I'm saying? Like, it just went down with a little situation, man, where these niggas was trying to Whoop the whoop, drop this tracks and shit like that, all goofy ass shit, bro. Like, you know what I mean? But, yeah, you know what I mean? Niggas was motherfucking posting these motherfucking, all this, this shit about me, my nigga, at the final end, a nigga post my music video. You know what I'm saying? A week later. I'm like, bro, what is you on, fam? You know what I mean? Like, you know what I mean? Come on, man, post the music, man. All this shit, y'all be trying to give, niggas be trying to give. Nobody niggas attentions, bro, just because everybody wanna see a David and Goliath match. You know what I'm saying? Like but don't nobody understand, you know what I'm saying, that people die in these streets. You know what I'm saying? No disrespect, you know what I'm saying? Even the beef that I had, we had to get it situated and sorted out. So, you know, niggas making it seem like it was gonna it was gonna be a bunch of shit, but it ended up getting resolved. You know what I mean? But Everybody want to see these matchups and shit like that, bro. But they don't understand, you know what I mean? Really, like, really people don't understand, like, you know what I mean? It costs money to beef with niggas. You know what I'm saying? And if you beefing with the right nigga, bro, everybody got to go. You know what I'm saying? Not Now, I'm not saying everybody got to die. But I'm saying this, bro, now you got to move your people. Now he got to move. Now your auntie, now you was staying right here. Now she got to move. You feel what I'm saying? Because the way these niggas All talk, the man. Like, All look, the like, then... Mm -hmm. Then, you know, you got niggas who can't move. What about your partner who can't go nowhere? You know what I'm talking about? Like type shit. So they fanning this shit. They fanning this shit, but they not understanding how you ain't sleeping well. You know what I'm saying? They don't understand how he ain't sleeping well, how you ain't sleeping well. You know what I'm saying? Because of this vlog done put this shit out, how both of y'all scared y'all might end up whoop the wop or locked up. Not even scared of whoop, you know what I'm saying? But just locked up and shit like that. Like these blogs, or this shit be real. Like, bro, y'all posting street shit, niggas, y'all stupid. You know what I'm saying? Square business, like, step back, bro. Like, for real though, fam. I don't, don't give no blow by blow on no street shit. Like, bro, you tripping, fam. Like, you tripping. And you know what I'm saying? Dry snitching. Yeah, man, that shit dry That's snitching. New age snitching. That's the new age snitching. Man, you know, I mean, Lord no matter if I post it or not. Yeah, real. You, you I mean, that's. I mean, that's just how I feel. I mean, that's just how I was raised. That's just how I was raised. I know that. No, no, This this track is at trouble two times. And, uh, like goddamn, let people assume or something. Bro. Like, bro, you don't have to tell. Let them people, let them people do that, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, then nigga all up in the video, man, this shit weird, fam. Like, you know what I mean? Like, on God, like I say, man, it was a bunch, it's a bunch of shit going on up in the city, bro. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Real shit. It's a bunch of rodents around here, too. So y'all be careful, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Who you fuck with, you know what I'm saying? As far as the streets, man, it's a bunch of rodents out here. Like, you know what I mean? I did a paperwork party. Right. Y'all seen it. 
You know what I'm saying? Shit yeah, get right real out here, man. You know what I'm saying? Say. So with that being said, man, stay you know. Stay in your motherfucking lane. Stay in your lane, lane man. Stay in your lane, careful, bro. Be careful, bro. But niggas want to see a David and Goliath, man. So in Dallas, man, be careful to how you get the more. It's going to be a super villain come up trying to take you down. You know what I'm talking about? You know what I mean? You trying to be super fly, super man. You know what I'm talking about? Be prepared for every chapter. It's going to be a new super villain. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Square business might be your baby mama. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Might be, you know what I'm saying? Might be your partner. You know what I'm saying? Might be them niggas that you, you know what I'm saying, used to be cool yeah. with. You mm -hmm. feel what I'm saying? Squad mm -hmm. business, bro. Man, what's the, man, shit real. Man, what's the thing you wish you would have known for I'm, I'm uh, before you even started, you know what I'm saying, your path on the, your career, you know? With I'm rapping? Saying? Yeah, man. Man, bro, I ain't man. gonna bullshit, man. One of the biggest things that hit me that that's a shocker to me, bro, oh, yeah. is that it could be, oh let me. Oh yeah. Well, it could be your closest nigga, blood. It could be your closest nigga, my nigga. I don't give a fuck who the fuck it is. If you start beefing with them motherfuckers, fam, or if you get in an argument with them niggas or anybody, bro, the first thing they gonna do, bro, is try to is start subliminally trying to throw shit at you through the net. And it's like this, blood. You know what I'm saying? People don't understand, my nigga. When you do that, you really sever like friendships, you know what I'm saying, or, or relationships. Even right. if you're my brother, you can be my cousin, bro. Don't talk about me on the motherfucking internet. Don't, you know what I'm saying, well, don't do none of that shit, bro. Right. But being a, as a regular person, a motherfucker wouldn't have never did that. Me and my nigga, we get in an argument, whoop -de -whoop, we might fall out real bad one night. You know what I'm saying? Right. Whoop, we see each other in the hood, whoop -de whoop ain't nothing. You know what I'm saying? I start, you start rapping, nigga, you gonna wake up in the morning, nigga, you gonna see something about that shit. That nigga gonna say something. These niggas out here think they so motherfucking tough. <laughs> you feel me? And that shit was pew. That's letting you know that I'll be careful. You know what I mean? Man, everybody, man, everybody want clout off you in some type of right. form. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Not everybody, not everybody, but the motherfuckers, like, I'm telling you, my nigga, like, motherfucker gonna you know what I mean? Real shit. You fall out with a motherfucker, be prepared, nigga. Oh, God. I don't give a fuck how, who you is, nigga. Right. They, they gonna say something. You know what I'm saying? It's some solid niggas. It's some solid niggas you can argue with. I ain't saying everybody in a circle like that, but I'm saying that it's shocking to me how motherfuckers go on, a, on try to go on bad campaigns or they different shit like that, man. They'll go to the extreme, man. Right. Mm -hmm. And if I knew, I ain't no motherfuckers, you know what I'm saying? Like, I wasn't paying attention to the rap scene like that before I jumped into it. I knew that it was beefs and shit going on, but I wasn't really, you know, I'm a, I'm a big thinker. Right, right, right. I'm a big thinker, bro. You know what I'm saying? I'm a gangster, I'm a big thinker, but I ain't do no big thinking on rapping. Right, 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 right. right. You know what I'm saying? I'm say, honest to say that. So, a lot of shit I learned along the way, like, you know what I'm saying, this beef shit, and then learning how this shit, you know what I'm saying, formed, and you know what I mean, how to play human chess with certain people, but... This shit mm -hmm. real, like, you know what I'm saying? I, I'm learning, I learned that nigga, I learned, I'm gonna tell you what I learned in this rap game. I learned that shit, nigga beef is real than a motherfucker. Like that rap beef shit, yeah, <laughs> that shit boy, real. that shit real, that man. That shit real, man. That shit real, man. <laughs> man. Alright, before we you get, get, you get on a song with another nigga, <laughs> and that shit, hey man, and that shit'll turn yeah. to something else. Nah, nigga, Dallas niggas, artists know this, man. You can jump on a song with the wrong Atlanta nigga, and you'll never go nowhere. So don't stop giving features from everybody who walk in the motherfucking city that you think a celebrity, man. Mm -hmm. Scoring business. You just scoring business, bro. You better know. Give, like, be calculated, man. Rap beef is real. I'm just saying, bro. Nah, for real. Rap beef real, bro. Knock, 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 nigga knock. Nigga, put your name on that shit. Niggas will, nigga will not fuck with you, nigga. Oh, who yeah. you fuck with? Y'all think, oh, I'm just gonna jump on the track with such and such. He down here. Okay. <laughs> Wonder why your ass can't. Wonder why don't nobody talk to your motherfucking ass. They don't bite you out. Be careful, fam. Know who you that fuck with and know you want to fuck with. Same problem years ago. Dallas, you know, yeah. you know, fucking outside artists putting the bag, you know, towards the outside instead of you know. At home, man. Home, where is it? Man? Home, where is it for you sure? You know what I'm saying? That water boy say, we say, we say, I'm humming with the right. You know what I mean? That ass nigga, that was for real. But yeah, night, man, before we get up out of here, man, like. I'm gonna ask, it's a question I ask everybody, you know what I'm talking about? If you was in my shoes, mm. what question you would ask yourself that I didn't ask you? Hmm. Man. Shit, bro. Shit, I don't know, man. Hell. 
You man, it's me, shit. You know what I'm saying? I think we did a great interview, man. Oh, you know what I'm saying? No incriminations. Nah, I think I did really. pretty smooth. <laughs> you dig it? I've been working on my etiquette. You know what I'm talking about? Oh, really? Oh, really? Oh, really? Nah, for real, for real. Saying shit. Nah, for real. Gotta watch what you say. Right, you know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, ain't asked too many of them bullshit questions, man. I've been in some interviews lately, man, where people ask me about motherfuckers and shit. You know what I'm saying? What I think about certain shit, man. You know, I don't want to hear that shit, man. Stop asking. Because then I've been them saying some shit. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, that I really didn't want to yeah, say, but yeah. you asked me about the motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? Right, like, right. I gotta stop mm -hmm. that shit, man. Nah, no, man, that's all about it. Like, like, that's one thing we missing here in Dallas, man. We see one thing in Dallas, man. We ain't never had like that. Oh, this is how it go, and this like, hey, nigga, come together and yeah. that structure. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like we were saying, it's and then I think like we need that platform to separate us, even though we know, man, everybody know it. it's a lot of niggas in Dallas that's it's on some street shit, and we know it's a lot of niggas in Dallas on some bitch shit, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. We know this, you know what I'm saying? And that's just like in every other city, you yeah, know what I'm saying? City, right, you know what I'm right. saying? But the, at the end of the day, you know what I'm saying? We got niggas out here who's making music. They dropping quality music no matter the, what the fuck they doing, you know what I'm saying? It's like, they, they deserve a light. Facts, Jay. and it's supposed to be a light, just like how you go to BET, or a light, just like yeah. how you go to motherfucking me drink traps, or a motherfucking yeah. light. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, Same man, light. Know, it be it. Some man, I'm telling you, Dallas just fucked up with a bunch of. It's just a bunch of beef shit, man. Right. That's all it is, bro. Because it's like <coughs> you could get a light, but everybody don't fuck like the artists who need the light. You know what I'm saying? Or or deserve the light, right? You know what I mean? Like it's about relate. It's politics around this motherfucker right now. You know what I mean? It's a bunch of politics. Like I say, you know what I yeah. mean? Like mm -hmm. it's a bunch of platforms that I'm just now getting on. Right. You know what I mean? I wasn't on. You know what I mean? Because right. just politics, bro. You know right. what I mean? Like you feel what I'm saying? So they don't push. They push their homeboys. That niggas in Dallas push their partners and shit. Right. Be a bunch of that shit going on. You know what I mean? You gotta really work to be. First, you gotta work hard to be on top of your motherfucking side of town. You gotta work hard to be on top of your <laughs> shit. <laughs> you get some motherfucker climb on top of a climb. No, 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 no. That's it's weird, bro. But it's yeah. like this. Nah, he, nah, he, he know two strikes against. Nah, he did. Nah, he did. Nah, that. Nah, he described it like this. How it is. Yeah, man. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta fight your way. You gonna make your, you gonna make your way through gun battles and all that shit. You know what I'm saying? And you know what I mean. You gonna build your. It's, it's fucked up. You gonna. You gonna build your reputation on your side, you know what I'm saying? Right. And then you gonna have to go through all them niggas on your side who gonna diss you. You feel what I'm saying? Then you gotta get on the. Then once you get over your side, you feel <laughs> what I'm saying? You gonna get on the city level. That mean nigga from Fort Worth can diss you. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Square business or a nigga from you know what I'm saying Austin, Arlington and shit like that. Mm -hmm. Then you gotta get you gotta be able to now you got now you gotta look oh now you're on top of the mountain. Now you got motherfuckers who up there mm -hmm. who trying who trying to fight for that nigga spot. It's just some weird shit. One of them niggas gonna diss you just out the blue. Ain't no, you know that nigga. You know what I'm saying? Z Nation, boy. Nah, you don't even know that nigga, man. Like for real, nah, this what's going on. Like I had this nigga just you know what I'm saying just pop up out the blue, man, you know what I'm saying? Like, nigga, nigga make a diss track about you, right? And the nigga who, that's on top of that hill, he'll laugh at it. You don't even know the nigga. You feel me? But what they doing is, they preparing. All right. Cause they see you coming up the mountain. Mm -hmm. You feel what I'm saying? They expect you to go ahead and take that bait. You feel yeah. me? That nigga Drake do, nigga Drake say, uh. You hear me? I'm dodging that shit, though. You know what I mean? I'm in my own lane. Don't hit me see, me, see me? I just go ahead and just go around it, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like I say, man, you know, I had some shit go on recently, man. Niggas dropping discs and shit like that, man. That shit there. You know? Man. But guess what? You know? Guess what? Hey. I come out, you know what I'm saying, being me, man. Man, you know tell them, man, 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 tell, man, tell them where they can reach you at, man. man. you can reach me at Trouble Two Times, man. That's uh, at T I uh, T R O U B L E T I M E Z, man. Uh, uh, Instagram, Trouble Two Times at Facebook, T R U B L E T W O. Uh, T I M E S. Man, where they can get that music at, man? Man, you already know I'm everywhere, man. Yeah, First, yeah, I'm gonna get that goddamn Afghanistan. 
Mm. Go get that now. You know what I'm saying? Release single, man. You can get that on iTunes, Spotify, Tap Amazon, in, Play, in. Google Play, all of that shit, man. Uh, title. You know what I mean? You can download it on all platforms. You know what I'm talking about? You can also watch the Afghanistan, no, Afghanistan uh, and look, I say Afghanistan. And, and, and shit is real. Yeah. You know no, what I'm talking no, about? No. Shit real, fam. You know what I'm saying? No, Afghanistan uh, uh, mm. video on YouTube. You know what I mean? We turning that bitch up. And then I got, uh, like I say, the mixtape coming out soon, man. You know what I mean? I turned that bitch up. We finna turn it up, man. Turn it up. Well, you already know, man. Y'all stay tuned in, man. We gonna keep dropping exclusives here on motherfucking Lit Podcast. You know what I'm saying? Like I say, everybody stay lit to life. You know what I'm saying? And we about this. Oh, before I get up out of here, everything, link in the description. You know what I'm saying? Make sure y'all turn in uh, Trouble Two Times. You know what I'm saying? Again, make sure y'all cop that shit. Do Lou. I mean, be loose. Shout out to you and everything. Shout out to the whole North. Shout out to the whole city. Triple D. Shout out to the whole DFW. You know what I'm saying? You know how we do it. Shout out to Ali Act too, man. Y'all know what it is, man. Uh, Ali Act closing, man. Y'all know what the fuck going on, man. We doing this shit for real. Nah, that shit, like, I like that. Yeah. Stitch too, you know what I'm saying? Keep the fake, you know what I'm talking about? Now you know that's pure quality, you know what I'm saying? So we about this bitch. I was into street shit. Hustling out of Grand Marquis Caprice. People always told me I wasn't gonna be shit. But I always knew that I would be.